digital romance, TV. Hi, my name is David Wygant. Welcome to Digital Romance TV. See this thing? We're going to talk about it in one minute. What I'm going to tell you, oh, wait a second. I, hold on one second. I have a text. Hold on. Hold on. I got a text. Oh yeah, I'm a dating expert, but I'm also an iPhone hater. And I'm going to tell you why this device is killing your social life. That's right. Over the next two minutes, I'm going to tell you why this little device, oh wait, I got another text. I'm going to tell you why this device is killing you from meeting people. The reason being is, is that we don't talk to people anymore. All we do is stare at this thing constantly. As a matter of fact, I shouldn't even be staring at the camera right now. I should be just staring at this and wondering who emailed me, who texted me. Wait, a friend of mine texted me. Let me get back to it. How many times do I go out and I see women standing there and awkwardly, they're just, they get real awkward. You can see it in that moment. And then what do they do? They just stare at their phone. And then at the gym, they stare, they listen to their phone. And then when they're out walking around, they're walking with their phone. You might as well marry your own phone. Forget about romance. And then men the same way. I see people in elevators where they could be talking to one another, but they're staring at their phones. I see people on buses. They're looking at their phones. I see people at lunch, sitting at a group community table, staring at their phone. And I even see people on a date staring at their phone. Here's the deal for you. You want to meet people? You want to go out there and really have a great social life? Then I strongly suggest you take this device and stick it in your pocket. And don't look at it when you're out in public. It might feel a little awkward at first because I know how addicted you are to your iPhone. But what this is going to do, it's going to open up a channel of energy, an energy of you being available. Smile at somebody. Say hello. Communicate to a living person the same way you would communicate to a person who you're texting. Never again take this out in public. Stick it where it belongs and see what happens and see how your life has changed. I'll see you soon. David Wygant, out.